Queen guitarist Brian May has been knighted in Britain's first New Year's honours list to be approved by the King. Sky UK reporter Adele Robinson has been speaking to the recipients. The headline act of the New Year honours list. Queen guitarist Brian May will be one of the first to be knighted by the King. I'm thinking about my mum and my dad and how the, they would be so happy and proud and whatever because we all want to please our mums and dads, don't we? And, um, you know, it was a long road for me. I, I displeased them for some of my life. Um, so I, I think they'd be happy that I landed up in this place. But the other thing I'm feeling very strongly is that this is a kind of challenge. It's taken me to a new place and it's it's a kind of commission. I think that's the way I regard it, to do good in the world and do better than I've done before. <laughs> And from rock star to lioness, four England women footballers on the Euro 2022 winning side have been recognised and made MBEs. One of them, Lucy Bronze. It recognises all of the achievements put together and says, yeah, you've achieved so much both as an individual and the team that you've played in, as a person, as a footballer. Um, and we recognise that and want to celebrate your success. And I guess that's the way I see it, is celebrating everything together. So I guess it goes right to the top. England women's coach Serena Wiegmann's also been given an order of the British Empire. And another sporting hero too, Olympic gold medalist Denise Lewis made a dame. It's 22 years ago since I won that gold medal in, in Sydney. And uh, so to be receiving a, an accolade as big as this, um, it's almost more the sweeter because it isn't for my single performance. It's it's for service to uh, the sport that has given me so much um, in, my, in my life. Among politicians honoured, Labour's Chris Bryant, Commons Standards Committee Chair, will receive a knighthood. I just know so many people in the Ronda who deserve this so much more than I do. Nurses, carers you know, posties, bus drivers and so on, let alone other MPs who deserve it more than I do. So I was really, really shocked. But most of the more than 1,000 recipients are lesser known, like clean air campaigner Rosamond, whose nine-year-old daughter Ella died from an asthma attack and air pollution in 2013. You know, when Sadiq Khan keeps on saying to me, you're saving lives, yes, I know, but I, I want, especially with asthma, I want children to stop dying, because I know in Scandinavian countries, children don't really die from asthma, and that's really what I want for children in this country. An honours list that nods to some highs and lows of recent years, celebrating both sung and unsung heroes. Adele Robinson, Sky News.